like this already. Yeah, I think The old comma van is what BT used to have in the 70s, wasn't it? Oh, it's a... I like the look of that. So it's like a little in private in railway, you know, for the the company, Berry Thorn and oh, Sons, because they're nice. all decked up with our livery. Oh, yeah, you forget about these things, but yeah, it's on. Industrial rail, yeah. Wait till you see this coming along, you can see it all written on the sides. It's really good. So I'm stood outside my comma van, watching the old loco come past. Freezing cold. So a lady there waiting for a husband to come out of the thingy. Not a cat. Is it a cat? It is a cat, yeah. He's feeding the cat while he's he's been kept behind. Mm. And they want to go out, they want to go to the working men's club afterwards, <laughs> don't they? I say it's cold, but she's only got a little dress on, so I'm mm. guessing this is springtime or something. Yeah. What's going on here? So who are these two here? Chatting away. Who are they? That's that's Ray. He looks <laughs> like a Ray, doesn't he? <laughs> so what's her name? Marlene. You right, Marlene? You doing anything like that? <laughs> oh, I don't know, Ray. Um, no. My old fella's give me some right lip at home, yeah? Mm. Oh, you ought to come out with me then, Marlene. Mm. <laughs> And don't see many. You yeah. don't know, but I was looking at the oats pipe there. Ah. That's very good, isn't it? Let's go up here a bit. I'm loving the background though, you know, because it's very slender, but it looks so good, doesn't it? You know, really. Yeah, much like me. Oh dear. <laughs> oh. That's <laughs> funny little locos, aren't they? Look at that. You like back that? Back to back, yeah. Oh, Local pipe work and everything. Yep, one sec, steam is coming. Let's go and stand with Ray. <laughs> He's changing the pipes. <laughs> Very good. I only stop there. Should we have a look at these buildings up here? Oh yeah, a lot going on there, isn't there? Can you imagine it seeing it like that though, can't you? If somebody's working on it there, you know. Always something to do, isn't there? Yeah. Chopping away, I like it. It's great. I like this one, Bob. <laughs> Who's giving the same over? Do. International Plastic Industries. But what I've just been told the secret of a lot of these are, yeah. you see these, they're all old pill bottles. Are they? Yeah, medication. Oh, right. How fabulous. I love seeing all the workmen on there. Well, you like kind of workmen, don't you? <laughs> And look at them, they're even up here, up high there as well. 
It's a lot of bottles there. Yeah, it's really good though, isn't it? It's so mm. surprising what you can do. Well, there we go. It's what you want to see, isn't it? Mm. Time's coming back. Let me new ring. Oh, it's lovely, isn't it? What is that, Vic? Sorry? What is it? It's a peak. <laughs> Could be a 44 or a 45 or even a 46. 45, there you go. So by the experts. <laughs> I think they all look the same, they just got a different bits inside. Ah, right. There is a technical term for the bits. <laughs> the slight differences. But those are those J9s. Ah, yes. I like this. An awful lot going on. That's what, sorry? Oh, is it? Right, okay. Yeah. Right, there he is. 3D printing is so, so amazing these days, isn't it? Yes, yeah, this should come on leaps and bounds, and in a few years it'll be, you know, coming even further. You won't need anything else. Everybody just making their own stuff. Yeah. <laughs> like they used to. Just a look, slightly different way. I like this. There we mm -hmm. go. It's really cute, isn't it? Oh, there it is. So, oh, that one stopped there. I see. Yeah. This is very nice. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> you can see that there's a big sign there. We've got a, it's like a Ferrari, that. And a German steam loco. That is very nice. It is, isn't it? Not what you expected, was it, to find today? No. I'm guessing it's. If it's German, then our friend Anthony in America would like that, wouldn't he? Because I know he's been looking at a few of these. In, um, you know, new liveries, but that is really nice. Yeah, I like that. That is good. I do like that. What's this? Pico. It's 20. HO. Mm. Oh. It says on it super detail. Yeah, but you can tell if you look under here, all the rigging and stuff. The, the brakes and the pipes there, look. Yeah, they're nice, aren't they? So yeah. those, are, those are removable for certain corners. It, it wouldn't get around, I think. Yeah. Yeah. So it's all option. Then you got all the real estate wood around the windows. Opening there. So DCC, so go on, how much is it? Oh, um... I don't know. A lot, probably. <laughs> it's a very good model. No price for that one. No. Tell everybody I actually won something on the tombola. No, you just did that. <laughs> a bottle of port. A bottle of port. Excellent. <laughs> I can't complain. Let's see some chocolates to go with it now. I know. Oh, I've just noticed the fire here, if you look. Sorry? Oh, yes. A nice warm oh. fire and a terrible... Oh, ducks. Ducks. Who doesn't love a Sorry, a the train's duck? there as well. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> Banana wagon on there. What I like about this, you got a light dusting of snow on it. 
Oh, it does look really All these nice. buildings look quite run down, don't they? And yeah. So there's S. Raven Gunsmith, M. Raven Saddler, Renton Art Supplies. Seeing that chap there lifting his car bonnet up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Phone box, couple of gas in there. So I'm guessing this is in Southern Railways, isn't it? Sure, where? Uh, set in the late 50s. Mother's Cafe. Meg's Cafe, yeah. Well, Meg's Cafe would be in this case, wouldn't it? Got a bookshop over there. And if you can just see, they're doing a first aid class there. One sec. <laughs> oh yes, first aid. Oh, it's good, isn't it? So these lovely cottages down here. It is a beauty. And that little dusting of snow makes it look amazing, doesn't it? It's like a Christmas card. It is. Yeah, yeah it's, it's not a blizzard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're not digging your way out. I really hate snow. Just right size for coming Yeah. Yeah. A bit heavy. Yeah, yeah, my brother used to have a Labrador and he used to get tired of it. Well, I'm not thinking you can carry him. Got a man inside. That's what I like to see. It's a nice breeze, that, isn't it? Yeah, when the door opens, it's lovely and warm in here, isn't it? Where are we today? We're at New Mills and District. Railway exhibition. It's our exhibition. It is our right. exhibition. So before we do anything else, we'll have a quick walk around and see what is here. Yes, I've already spotted the sweet store. Okay. I'll call there later. Right. So <laughs> we'll wander first. So we got Bazzi's model rail, trackside videos. Oh, Another trader there. I'll stay off those for now. <laughs> it's 34th and Vine called Kennington, Peak Railway, Ecclesbourne Valley, been there a few times, Worm Hill, what's that one called, Glen Seas, MMR kits again, We've got Sandling Junction. What's this trader here? Oh, there's some good. Oh, look. <laughs> well, look late. Oh. Yeah, we got that one. Hiya. You all right? Hi. Yeah. See yeah, we don't got that one. <laughs> we'll come back. Another one. Sorry? <laughs> yeah, we've got a few of them, yeah. <laughs> but we'll, we'll definitely be back later. That's a nice yeah. lady we've not seen before. It goes on with the military theme. <laughs> <laughs> Macclesfield Model Railway Club. Oh, Dale Light well. Railway. There is, yes. Some demos going on there. Some more traders down there. And here. Some static steam. We've got here another trader <coughs> and another one. It's a good depot, isn't it? Oh, isn't it? It's a new one. I was there. Not heard of that one before. No. 
That's a nice one, Thomas. And we're back at the sweet stall and where we started. Sweeties. Hello, you all right? How you doing? So we got some stuff in the middle, a couple more layouts. Society. Yep. Um, Linden Grove. Coronation Lane. Coronation Lane. Ah. One in the toilet. Hello. Hello. Bottom. Oh, we'd heard about this one. <laughs> yeah. But if you had this in Australia, it'd go the way the train, wouldn't it? <laughs> Fantastic. Good. Why not? familiar there, doesn't he? <laughs> so we've got sand egg. We'll start here. Oh. You've got the seagulls, you've got the boats, you've got a ship. You can see the mail come right down to you. It's good, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. All that. This is the one we saw at Rain Hill, wasn't it? I think it probably was. We did, yes. You only did a very tiny bit of it there. Yeah. Look at it now, it's amazing. All it wasn't at the Rain Hill one, it was my man, wasn't it? Go on, <gasps> undo your thing. <laughs> Ready to go out. All right, okay. So I would suggest you take... Oh, no, just well, you, you, you... Isolate that. Okay. No pressure. Take that locomotive over there. And in the moment, it will oh. be switched on. You tell me when we're ready. Are we ready? That is, that's right. And that is on your line. Ah, oh, right, okay. Ah. Okay, stop. Okay, you're going to back onto that train. Okay. Uh, well, I don't want to go too, I don't want to run into it. So, no, it's me? Oh! It's alright, just make sure. I wish you could park your car like that. <laughs> I know. Just give it another inch further back. Stop there, that's it. Don't let it stop. Keep ah, it you see, this is what I need to learn. Sorry. Coming in. Ah, we're going to go all the way that way. It's going to come all the way down here. See, an expert already, honest. I'm not jealous, Sorry honestly. Sorry the delay. <laughs> We just hope it doesn't lose any part of the train and route. <laughs> Apologies if you're expecting anything more. I'm, I'm, I'm you new done? to this. No, we're getting another one. Sorry? I'm getting another train. All oh, right, okay. Mm. The blue one? <laughs> no. Right. You'll have to wait this and see. This will be a simple into the station, run round, Okay. Here we go. And it's all the way into the station, and that's where the uncoupler is. There, so the back of the engine is going to be over there. Right, let's slow it down. Slow it down. Where do you want me to take it? Well done. Just take it onto the pier because you're going to run round your train. Um, Further? Or? Okay. Is that enough? I'll try and do better this time. 
It's just the couplings, the different styles we're used yeah, to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that'll be coupled, that now. And keep hold of it. Yay! I remembered. I do listen, honest. Off we go. So we've got a lovely turntable there. Oh, another forklift there. And another forklift. <laughs> I do like that signal box there. Yeah. Love being able to see everything inside. Let's have a look at the country area here. Now we've just learned a little secret. All these reeds here next to the water are actually mm -hmm. paintbrushes. The cheapest paintbrushes, just dipped in paints and let, dry let, them, let them to Break dry and again. harden. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And PVA, yeah. Yeah, nice. I love tricks of the trade. Very nice, isn't it, this area yeah. here? Yeah, you can imagine being able to sit down and just look over it. Yeah, because it's just got almost separate from the actual railway. Yeah. It's own little area, isn't it? Yeah, it's a lovely layout. Fabulous. I don't realise how dirty the track gets. Today, we're at Preston and District Model Railway Show. Let's go and enjoy. So, as I said, quick walk round first. And then we'll get stuck in. But we'll start here. So you've got the whole history of Hornby Pullmans here. So you've got the early triangle ones, which are a bit very small. Then you go on to these. Then they change colour to these. <laughs> We've got, got the newest ones. Quite these sets as well, you know. Yeah, I mean you always like the different colour changes oh, yeah. that's just due to the you know which batch was done there's no is that the newest no that was that's from the 80s that color started and that one started in the 70s yeah. and that's what we got here So Mark II. I think that's a Lima one that. And this one. That's an Airfix one. I don't remember this one. No. It's this. Right out to make out the colour, isn't it? It's main line. Is it? Yeah, it's Mark 1. Let's have a little, quick look here. Yeah, got some men ones there, look. Well, oh, oh god. Yeah, look, look. Oh, and he's got a card machine. <laughs> oh dear. What are they? There's some more there. Oh. I'll tell you what they are. Well. Some of them are on a list. Oh. <laughs> but it's not an offenders one. <laughs> so yeah. which ones have I don't want to tell anybody in case they nick it. <laughs> but if anybody's watching will know. Yeah. Let's go before we do anything dangerous. Yeah. There's another one there. Come on. <laughs> Scared of buying. Scared of buying. <laughs> anybody who's not in vicinity now is the blue one. <laughs> Oh, look at all that lot. <laughs> Still think some books. Allowed. We've seen this one here. Oh, there's a camper van. So we've got a lot of sheep. That is a fantastic river. Look at those trees there. Where are we? Whithorn. Whithorn. Ah. Um, double O gauge, isn't it? Look at the greenery. It's lovely, isn't it? You know, some lad would be trying to sell you that in a bag on a BMX bike, wouldn't he? <laughs> look at the mill down there. No, but have you seen the ramblers? Oh, somebody love them out of the way. Oh, that's... Wow, look at this. It's very good. There's a lot going on here, isn't there? Loads of people about. Got the cattle pounds. It's very deep, isn't it, this layout? 
She's been busy at West End as well, you know. Yeah. Working hard. You can build in some of that. Old cars there. Old camper vans on here. <laughs> What was that for? A heartbeat. <laughs> yeah, it's very good. Old wagon there. It used to be a wagon like that behind my mum's house, you know, abandoned. And he's off. Nice noises. I just love the scenery on here, the grass and everything. Yeah. Those trees are amazing, look. The river actually They're goes like round. Taking your eye, aren't they? The, ri the river goes round the back as the trees are as well. Oh, nice river. I noticed. Yeah. And that bridge there as well. And the farm. Yeah. Little dog. Oh. Yeah, it's good this. Yeah. yeah there's no trains down to this end, but it's just so nice. The fencing's brilliant as well. Yeah, yeah. This is the exciting bit. Yeah. But all the kids want, let like, alone the adults. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh wow. And it's on. I'm guessing it's going. Oh, that's really good, isn't it? Worth waiting for. Definitely. <laughs> Yay! Look at that. Nice. Perfect. Yeah, that was the hardest one to repair it, though. Yeah. Oh, but you're beautiful. Oh, he's made a new I don't think I've got any treats in there, but there might have been some at some point. My dog. <laughs> Bobby would love it's this one. Fine. <gasps> what have you got? What are those? What are those? Oh, she's beautiful. She's hungry. <laughs> she's always hungry, I can imagine. <laughs> She oh, no. is. Oh, no, no, no. She's beautiful, aren't you? Is that good? Good girl. What's here? Oh, she's beautiful. Yeah. It's understandable. That's fine. You're allowed to be. Yeah. Oh, what's that? Oh. He's having a chat with that guy in the Land Rover about, isn't he? Oh, and another forklift truck there. It's a little man, sorry. It's oh, yes. Nice oh. little shunter. There's quite a few here. You've got this one here as well, this 08. Look. And the forklift. Like the fire in the oh, yes. in the barrel. Mm. Those are Metcalf kits as well. Obviously, you know, done some alterations. I can see a pigeon set up there as well. I've noticed that, but there's also a dog there. Is, he, is that another dog in the doorway, or is it? Oh, a cat? I have no idea. Are you barking at there's it. A, there's <laughs> a lot of a lot of um, Pigeons and birds and... I was going to say there's another one on the top there. Yeah. Well, that's what you get, isn't it, near railways? They're always yeah. full of pigeons. Yeah. It's a bow bow, anyway. This one looks really old, and that to me looks really old. I don't know why. I don't know if it is. I think we made in the but... 50s, maybe? Early 60s? You carry on using them, you're until the... The nineties. I like that you were slowing down the braking. We've seen one in use at the East Lancaster Railway. Well, it's going now. Oh, there we go. Chatting over with. Time to get a move on. He's not in a rush, is he? <laughs> Yeah, 
I like about these smaller layouts, you know, like in the enclosed. You can always do more with the lights and both. Yeah. Not a next half put on this, isn't there? Yeah. Oh, yeah. like this one again. Oh, yes. I like that one as well. Weathered as well. See it on the. Yeah. I'm going to do that one by the door and then. We'll get that one by the door and then we'll go and get a. Got a nice pack here. Not noticed this before. All right. A pack of three weathered um, trucks and a brake van. So nice. So we did look at one of the old Hornby versions of this here. These are obviously the much newer, you know, finely detailed ones. Yeah. So yeah, very nice. Oh, and I've just seen something under there. What else? I've no, I don't know what it is. <laughs> So I got we have four rooms to do. <laughs> She's two more than last was it three last week to start here. Nice pink diesel. Breaker mark two's behind it. That looks very smooth, doesn't it? It does smooth. You can see all the people inside as well. Fabulous. Excellent. See the traffic on the road up there. Yeah, it's quite a glossy, isn't it? <laughs> there's a heck of a lot of cars there. I think there's a jam somewhere, don't you? Yeah. Oh, they're just all out for the day, and it's I'm just on a. I'm guessing it's say at the end of the 70s, early 80s. There's a lot of British Leyland stuff in there. Oh, and 47 coming past. Where is it? Break of empties. Yeah, it's not very often you see empty, is it? No, it isn't. Again, really smooth. Sure are. Mm, look at them all. I love the long ones. Alright, there's another one. Ah. There we go. I mean, we've seen the amount of trees in the background there. I know. It's a proper forest, isn't it? Absolutely amazing, that. I'd hate to take this thing apart. I can't even imagine I'm how sure long it is. I'm sure there's an act to it. I mean, this is taking up the whole room. Simon has got some bargains. Or a bargain. Just, one. Just the one bargain. Oh. Oh, that's very. nice. Oh, eight pounds. Very nice. There you go. That'd be good for my terrier. <laughs> would, yeah. yes. So busy. There's something going on. There's some sort of jam, isn't there? <laughs> I mean, if you've got a lot of cars, then you've got to put them somewhere, haven't they? I can There's see coaches and everything, isn't there? Yeah, it's an Invercar, Mark 2 Escort, Triumph Stag, Capri, Mark 1 Escort. Can't see what that is. Triumph TR6, maybe. Ooh, what's this? Class 47. It's moving an awful lot in our traffic. It's like an express freight, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. In the back there, you've got a Leyland at Plantier and Bus. And look up there, you've got a, a lime green Allegro Estate. <laughs> How fantastic is that? Is that Capri in front as well? The is, green Capri, yeah. Is there another? There is another lime green Allegro. <laughs> what are the chances of that happening? <laughs> They're going to give a special wave to each other, won't they? Yeah. Oh, I'm pal. And in front, there's a, there's a blue Allegro stay. <laughs> Somebody likes the Allegros. Look at this little one. He's hiding out there, isn't he? Yeah. What a fantastic layout, though. It's just so big, isn't it? Yeah. That is good, that. Let's have a... It's our mate's last one.
Oh, let's have a look behind the scenes. Okay, oh my yes. goodness. 1 to 34, look at that. It's a spotter's dream, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. I don't, we can't see obviously that side of it, but look. Look at that controller there. Oh, well, let's get a look in. That controller. That's amazing. Yeah, we even got a video there. Isn't it? And this is Barrymore Model Railway Group. Have a look. Here it is, yeah. Oh, here we go. Quite a good place to stand, actually. <laughs> it is. Uh, it's like being backstage at a gig, isn't it? <laughs> you know, waiting for the, the artist to go on. We'd be out of freight train for the Rolling Stones, wouldn't it? <laughs> Sorry. So you've got quite a lot of novelty wagons here. I love a novelty one. It's the early one with the white roof. Could be completely wrong. Ah. St. Ival. That's a lemur. Mm. I see so many of these. There's one there. There's one there. There's one there. Oh, a caboose. It's the old Tryon caboose. Oh, yeah, yeah. All these Wren wagons up. <laughs> See, Wren did a lot of novelty wagons, and I got so. Believe it or not. Oh, yeah. All of the fame you know for the heavy die cast locos, but they did a lot of novelty wagons as well. We got so. There's that LMS one again, look. Oh, yeah, the red one. Brand new. The right couplings on this time. It's a good price, that, isn't it? Yeah. Not by the top. Very that. bright. Got your blue Pullman coach. Nice, aren't they those? It's added new wheels added that. Oh really? Yeah, they came on chunky old plastic ones. Oh, what is that? <laughs> see, oh there you go. There's the plastic ones. Ah oh, right, I see. A lot of Pullmans. Beautiful. What are these ones? They're Triang. Um, Continental design. Ah, right. Oh, another one. <laughs> they did sell a lot of them. Well, these are nice. It's all the Lima ones, I think. Lima HO scale. Crane. Fleischmann coach, twelve pounds. Some more HO here. For this one. Life lumber. like trains, forest lumber. Huh? Oh, that's, that's the, we never actually got a grain forest wagon, have we? Oh, look yeah. at the packaging. Unusual nice, couplings. Oh, they not they, the norm. Oh, they still work, but they're just different. I do like the packaging on those. Yeah. The later mainline one. It's the next Airfix one. You can tell by the plastic packaging and the different couplings. Oh, can you? Yeah. You do recognise a lot, you don't you? You take a lot in of... Misspent, just misspent you. <laughs> well, there's that we saw the other day, the Roanoke one. Do you remember? Oh, yes. We were tempted at the time, weren't we? Yes. I like that one, there. Mobile. Yeah. Mm. Look at this tank here. It's a big one. It is, isn't it? Don't, don't normally see them that big. Usually six wheels when they're that big, aren't they? That's the next mainline one. Cool. Unusual, Radford, Parkinson's and Co. The Lima video we've just done, that's lovely that, isn't it? There's so much more detail on the Lima Continental even, stuff. Even how old it is. Yeah. It works perfect. Those coaches are fantastic, aren't they? Look at the detail on them though. 
That's beautiful, that. Yeah, lovely. Yeah. yeah? Mm. Thanks for showing us that. It's really good. It's the same anyway, so. How much is it? Go on, tell us. 40. The set. Really? It's a good price. Yeah. yeah. I'm just selling it for a friend. He's just had it stored right. for years. Yeah. He just wants to get a little bit back. So. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's nice, that, isn't it? It's really nice. Yeah. Well, Look at that go. Oh, that's nice, that, isn't it? For the coach as well. It's really it's nice, lovely. isn't it? That bridge is scary, though. I don't think I'd like to travel on it myself. Well, I would. But it is amazing. But it's come along since you last saw it. It has, hasn't it? it? Oh, that's really sweet, that. Let's have a look under the bridge here. Horses and carts. That's amazing, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, the construction of it all. Wow. I know. And leading into the tunnel there. And I've just noticed some steps down, so it's yes. like a, a walkway all along, just on the other side there. Mm. Wow. Never seen a layout like this. It's amazing. Wow. Very nice. Oh, I see people in there. Yes. Oh, stick go. <laughs> really nice. Work in progress, yes. Oh, horse and cart there as well. There's another one. It's different, isn't it? Going that way. It's fabulous horse and cart and everything. I still think it looks scary. Probably <laughs> <laughs> is a bit, yeah. I'm really not sure I'd like to travel on it, but yeah. Another European one here. Not sure. Look the name the... of this one, but no. a horse wheel. Yeah, it's really nice, isn't it? Isn't it? Look at them and two it's there. good to see the difference. Oh, look at that. It's beautiful, isn't it? Imagine yeah. getting on that, can't you, for a ride yeah. round? It's like Switzerland or somewhere, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. They're making the bench there. Let's move along. The track as well. It's a narrow gauge, isn't it, by the look of it? Just carrying the washing. <laughs> and skiing later. We've got a Porsche there. What is that? Wow. Not sure what that is. What is it? <laughs> it's a, a rail inspection vehicle. Oh, right. Ah, rail inspection vehicle. Fabulous. Continental version of the Wickham trolley. Fabulous. Like something James Bond would have in a lair. <laughs> Secret underground. I like it, though. Yeah. And this joins on beautifully. You can see it still needs to have progress, some work in progress, it, yeah. but fabulous. I love how the buildings are so detailed. You've got the hanging baskets and everything on there, haven't they? Exactly. <laughs> Fabulous. Look at it all. There's so much going on. There is, isn't there? It's yeah. hard to see it all. I mean, look at this ship here. I know. It's a great model in its own right, isn't it? Yeah. All lit so up in... everywhere. Oh, look, it's coming on. I'm going to go on the boat. Look at that. What a smooth one as well. Just, you just don't see it, do you? But that's fabulous. Oh. That looks nice as well. I do like that one. Yeah. Look in this building here. I was just yeah. going to say, we spotted it at the same time, what you can see inside. Things going on.
Chuck it down here? Yeah. Well, you can see it from here, inside. Oh, it's a yeah. brewery. Oh, right, of course. And then you come down here, you got the river and the, the bridge. And you go down here, you got old horse and carts, though. You can imagine that bridge moving, can't you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, some coming across the bridge. Mm. Oh, easy. That one there. <laughs> Is that because you like Commons mustard? I do love, love mustard, yeah. But it's just it's got a red chassis. Yeah. When do you ever see a wagon with a red chassis? Never. No. So I think we'll take that one. <coughs> Good. Yeah. Right, let's have it. Hello. I'll take that first. What have we got here? The tabby caps. Oh, How tiny <laughs> How are you going to tell? And they've been painted. Let's have a look. Wow. <laughs> really? That's oh, oh that's upside down. I could sell that one. Ah, and that's unpainted. Can't so see our dog, are you? Wow. You swallow the cat. How is that going to work? <laughs> I can't wait to see that. But yeah, so that's unpainted and painted. But I believe you. Yeah. <laughs> well, you'll see how low this is ginger like me. Just yeah. a mile. Ooh, what's this one? It's a um, Great Western tank engine. They do a few versions of them, you know the um, the pannier tanks? Oh yeah. Some don't have a cab room, some do. <laughs> and look here. <laughs> oh, it's hard, it's, or, well, a police box rather. You've got the rail car at the back there, look. Oh, look at these. Got some big cogs and so on on there. Mm. And off it goes. Does that cost us a rail car? It is, yeah. We really like buy these. the Great Western Railway. Oh, right, okay. Then British Rail ran them as well in different colours. I mean, most people prefer the, the original Great Western livery. Yeah. But you did see them in red, green. Um, cream and red. What you're making, it's just been modded a bit, hasn't it? The, the kit. Yeah. yeah. That's what they should look like. <laughs> I can't keep you in the shins, you know. <laughs> yeah. <be> your dog. <laughs> oh, look at the smoke from the chimney as well. Mm. It's running there. <laughs> Look at them, aren't they beautiful? Nice, aren't they? Lit up inside. They're really nice, pulling into the station. Oh. Um, drive and gun. That, that coach shouldn't be there, really. Yeah. Ended up going down the unrealised it not close to the So here we are, Neeps End Model Railway Society's exhibition in Sheffield. So no longer in trouble, just going to go straight in and look for some bargains. Yeah. We're at Mount Tabor Models, and some specialises in the continental stuff. And every time I look on here, I see something I haven't a clue what it is, but it's just amazing to look at. <laughs> the, the detail and the quality is absolutely amazing. Yes, what's that little thing there? That looks lovely. Oh, sorry. This one here. Wow. That's very... Like you say, the detail on it, isn't it? Yeah. Wow, well, it's 169, but it, it's brand new and it's good quality, isn't it? It is. I mean, we are so used to looking for the bargains, but you can't help admire. Well, you can get new bargains as well. 
Yeah. Uh, some things are priced better than others. Yeah, but yeah. But they're just as good, you know, you just gotta look around. I've always liked these, these German ones. Oh, right. Very, you know, popular loco. They are very nice. Some Lilliput's coaches. That's a pack of three. Oh, right. I'm gonna pick that up. Well, it's a good idea because that's how mm. you want them, isn't it? Is a minimum of three. Yeah, isn't it is. It? And you've got a, a nice rail car there. That is nice. I'm just gonna pick what catches my eye without any clue what they are, but there you go. <laughs> and you got your, your narrow gauge stuff here. Just look at that. <laughs> you like that? Mm. Hello. I'm just the cameraman, ignore me. <laughs> he has his uses. No. Not yet, no. Right, so that's the other one. Right. What's the, what do you do is just turn that to the top, we're going to get to the set. There we are. Yeah, yeah. Start it there, that way. The outer one, that's uh, Thomas, he's had a hiccup at the moment. Oh, right, okay. I'll give him a hiccup, I'll give him a hiccup. Oh, right. There we go. Oh, oh, lovely. Sorry, right. let me get this one going. And then... It's Tommy. Tommy? It's Thomas, when he's fully grown, it's an 060. Oh, all right. And that's an 042. So he's still drilling his third wheel. <laughs> Wait a minute, the station. Slow it down. A bit faster. Oh, it's gone a bit too slow. There we go. Perfect. Yeah. Perfect. Get that. All in. Give him a nudge. Oh, is that mine? Oh, little cute unit. What? Can I get to see you? <laughs> so I'm on this one, aren't I? Uh, I'm a, I mean, I'm that, that one. That? Sorry. Right. <laughs> oh, look at it move. Look at it get. Look at them things go. I'll turn it down a bit. Isn't it lovely? Oh, look. It's definitely recording this time. <laughs> so you got a fast western here, you yeah. the driver in there. It's the Golden Oak delivery. It's a one off, I think. So you have in blue, green, sand, and you have this one, this liver. I like it, I like it. It's not what you expect, it's not the norm. Something coming Ooh, down what's here. What's coming along? So class 50. And this is Exeter St George. Oh, okay, guys, yeah. Mm, very nice. Look at the detail in front of that, Liz. There's a lot going on with that. Yeah. Defiance, it's called. Very nice. Now, whether this one is as well, really nice. Lovely to see them going. It's cool us down a bit. <laughs> yeah. Got a nice selection of cars there. It's in there. Somebody can name them all. Put it in the comments. <laughs> hey, well, what have we got down this end? Look at these little ones. Uh, well, the little buildings. Not bad yeah. pricing. Well, look at that set there. The Diamond Jubilee one with the gold wheels. Oh gosh, yes. yeah, we're even looking at that. No, there's so much to look I, at. I was, Sometimes I'm too busy forget. looking at the buildings because it's such, yeah. it feels came like in, a good place. Can you remember what we came looking here for? Buffers. Oh, right. <laughs> we see <laughs> just buffers, yeah. At least yeah. on track. Um, 
Yeah, we didn't quite go as far as the buffers. No, we didn't. No, on some coaches. Oh, well, let's have a look. Oh, they're a good price. Six pounds. That's really know, good. We've we need one of them. I was spending some more money. One, we've got that one. Those. I need to get a load more of those. I'm still looking for the loco to go with them. You're in the matching one. Ah. It's quite a rare one. Higgs. Sorry. Not uh, that one, Higgs. So many rent. Although they were a small company, they did absolutely loads of wagons. Wow. And some of them are quite rare. Right. What's for three pounds? Ah, Mighty whites. Yes. We got one in the set, didn't we? Oh, look at that weathered caboose. <gasps> nice. It's HO. Yeah. Maybe it's not, maybe it's yeah, a painted dog. It's a limited edition of 4,000 anyway. It is beautiful. Okay. I'm sorry, I was just having a look on the back to see what the... It's a general layout, isn't it? Maybe it's because it was the Golden Jubilee. Maybe it's a Diamond so. Jubilee, what are we on about? <laughs> I don't know, but it's a good price anyway. Yeah. Right, let's crack on. Hi. Can I just see what time it is, Polly? Three o'clock, we've got two yeah. hours. Oh, right, okay. Let me just swap shoulders. Go down the middle. Good, isn't it? And they've got a rail riders wagon on this set as well. <laughs> nice I think it's compulsory, it. isn't it? It's yeah, yeah. Enough. I think you're going to be here. You've got to. So this is called Wenstead. Can you find four caps? Oh, no. Sorry. Yeah, not late got, uh, got distracted. There's quite yeah. a few things, isn't there? There's cement mixer. You look for the cement mixer. I look for the caps. Oh, yeah. Not a chance. As long as they're not hidden somewhere, they're in, no, everything's... in plain view somewhere. Yeah, there, there, yeah it, there's some things you might got looked on a cut like a, an alleyway or something like that, but everything's... Cement mixes over there. Over there. Yes. Nothing um, fell off in transport. <laughs> good idea. Found the cement mixer, that's good. Why that abandoned bit on top there? We'll give you a clue. There's the first car. Ah. But you can sort of see the size of it then, can't you really? Yeah, a bit small. You carry on with the cats, I'm going to look for other things. Quite a taxi I'm after. Okay. Taxi. The taxi? What? Oh, it's uh, just on the other side the of that building. Cab, yeah. yeah. It's a bit easier to see than a cat. I'm not looking at the pigeons, I might be here all day. Yeah, I normally look at the lights first, because you normally sit on top of the lights, don't you? And building, oh, oh this, there's something. There's a couple. There's one. How many are you after? I think there's six pigeons. Six. So, uh, oh. Did you have a look somewhere on the platform? Oh, there is two there. I'm blind as a bat. So there's one more. I'm quite good at, well, no, I say I'm quite good at it. I'm not great, but, oh, hang on, let's, let's find a washing machine. That's going to be with the old, is that that? What's yes. Up? Is it? Yeah. I think you can't see it from this side. Oh, the washing machine, yeah. You can't tell it's a washing machine. But you can it once you know. <laughs> Does it have a hole on your side? Yes. Is it sat on the wrong way then? So yeah. You... yeah. It's making it a bit harder. Is that a Make toilet? It so I don't. I don't know if it's supposed to be there. It but... is. Yes. It's not on the list. No kitchen sink though, is it? Mm-hmm. Dracula. In his coffin and a man on roller skates. Probably Cliff oh, Richard going around Pebble Mill in that video. <laughs> Dracula's coffee. Another Dracula Rango. Well, it's a bit of an harder one, that one, isn't it? I'm going to keep looking now. It'll be easier. There's going to be a big bloke, isn't it? <laughs> Bigger than a well, damn he, pigeon. He's in the coffin, so you've got to find the coffin. Exactly. Look on the bridge. No. Oh, there. <laughs> there you go. That's really good, that. The bridge. That's nice. Yeah, I like that. Huh? Oh, really nice. I see the broken trees and that have fallen in. Let's go around the... Oh, no. Oh, catch going with the bridge again. Uh, uh, there we go. Yeah. 
Yes. It's amazing, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, all right. It's really good, isn't it? It's a pretty locomotive, isn't it? Isn't it? Whether that's uh, uh, wheat or barley. Yeah. Very handsome, I've got to say. Oh, it's That's good, that doesn't it? A lot more every time you come back to it, you know, you're thinking, I didn't see that before. Right? I know, that wharf there is amazing. Isn't Just it? Here. The layout is called 29th Street Wharf. It's great. Scott's Landing. <laughs> and the graffiti on the cars. It's really good. I didn't notice all the lighting, all the building inside. It's all lit up with offices and. Yeah. Hmm. Look at those nice tank engines. I do like those westerns though. Look at this quickly. You can't get to this one because they're all the children, but they're loving it, absolutely loving it. And it's the dinosaur one. But all the kids are in it, you see, and we just can't squeeze in. Okay. <laughs> That's not a bad thing. I'm not going to argue with them. <laughs> Right, this is Air Valley Models. We always buy something off this chap, don't we? We do. He's a regular. Oh, so that's the Airfix 31 in its original packaging. Ah. We've got a green one with no packaging. What else have we got? Oh, look at these. I see many of these these days. Mainline tank engines. Oh, uh, yeah. And a little pug. Oh, who is that? We've got one. I think ours is a different livery, though. Mm. See, you're looking at these two mainline tank engines. You've got that one there. You've still got the motor inside, you know, blocking the view. Mm. Obviously, right revised it when they brought this model out. It's a completely different loco. It's probably similar underpinnings, but you can actually see all the detail now. Oh. It makes a big difference. Yeah. 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 And Backman obviously took over and improved it. So on this one, when it's gone to Backman, it has they've got rid of all the motor inside and made a put better motor in so you can see the driver, but it is the same loco. Oh right. It's good. It's, it's, it's good progress, to see how isn't things it? change. Well, yeah, exactly how things have changed. What's this one? Yeah. That looks yeah. like an even newer version. They might have retooled it at some point, but that's the modern yeah. equivalent of the J72 they're called. Which is that one, fifty pounds? Yeah, it's that's really not, lovely, isn't it? Though it's not, it's not a bad price, I think. It's not, not that I know enough about. No, it's, it's a really nice model. 
I like that. I like that green as well. We've, we've got one in green, but it's a really bad runner. Do you remember the £10 one we got? Oh, right. Yeah, that was the... Like that, but green. Ah. The very first version. Nice, though, that. I like yeah. that. Um, what else we got? Oh, nice I was, coaches. I was going to say that. They're looking really good. These are metal. I was wondering, you know, because I, when I looked at them, but... What the heck are those? Uh, they're really they're nice. nice. Are they kits or...? Proper couplings. Mm. Wow, they're amazing. That's what I thought. I don't know what they are. Ask. Can we ask him? Yeah. What coaches are these? Uh, company Paul they were, they were really top, they were top notch coach at the time. Well, how yeah. old are they? They'll be probably 19, early 1960s. Are they that old? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. But they, don't they look beautiful? They, they were made. They're metal, aren't they, and they were, everything, yeah. They yeah. I don't break it. <laughs> <laughs> you got to sell that. So they, were, they were meant to go with, uh, I think the brass map to go with arm double. Were they? Uh, as, as an improvement to arm double. How much are they? £40 each. Each? Each. Oh. I'm going to show them a new coat. Oh no. Well, they're just so beautiful, aren't they? Yeah. Oh. I know. Oh, get it. Get it. I'd be up for that. I mean, it's too, too much to put that onto me. I am. When you must come across some stuff, sometimes think, I'm never going to see that again. It's lovely. What do I do with it? Like them? I'm surprised you sell because I've never seen them before. How many do you think they did? Oh, I wouldn't like to say. Uh, I'm not special at all. That's beautiful. It's all metal as well. Really? Yeah. I know they did them in Ogate. The Ogate. They are really nice. The paint works amazing, isn't it? So that was that, was it? No? No, that, that, just, that was just a box. Where was it? No, it's not, it's oh, we just sat on top of it, though, yeah. Yeah, so you've got the Cornish they review. Are they are beautiful, they are, yeah. And that's what's caught his eye, you know. I mean, they don't look battered or anything. They look brand new, don't they? They look so, so well looked. Mm. So well looked after. That is really nice. Yeah. I've never, to be honest, I've never really looked them up to see how much they are worth. Yeah. I've just blessed the price of what I pay for. Yes. I think with something like that, it's what anybody wants to pay. Well, it is. What's that one? Is that the that, same? That's a, a, a yeah. Oh, the same actually as well? The same, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Take one. That's beautiful, isn't it? I love the windows and everything. It's all just really nice. I think this is the the detailed Smokey Joe. Oh, right. So you look at it. Centenary year, limited edition. So they actually made him a lot more detailed. Oh. Yeah. I've seen one for sale before. I've only got 12 foot you want in Oh, yeah. It's a nice livery. Yeah. Oh, here you go. This will do you. <laughs> Professionally weathered 37. 244 quid. Wow. Okay, you for Christmas if you want. <laughs> no. Can we go these? I can't spend that sort of money, me. Oh, you can on blooming plants. <laughs> <laughs> what's he got here? <laughs> the weathered wagon with Santa. though isn't it honey there'll be some things to do with the ladies football <laughs> might be which might. we would have watched ordinarily yeah. shake a salt <laughs> you always pick the salt ones <laughs> i don't know why every, every video you pick a salt one <laughs> it's behaving do you know what it's like for you 
Ah, oh, at least well, somebody's well behaved. It's called Port Ross. Come here, boss. <laughs> oh, look at this. I've seen this one before, I don't feel as We've so never seen this one, no. Look at that, it's it lovely. See how the keeper inside and everything. Enjoying the seaside. Yeah. You got a man carrying a bin there. You can see right in these buildings. People sat there. down having a brew. A motorbike and sidecar. Somebody's fixing the booth. Oh, and the market's on today. Quite right, Sunday, isn't it? <laughs> Oh my goodness, look at that. The Undertaker with his um, coffin on the side car. Yeah. Not what you expect at all, is it? No, there's a lot going on here. Yeah. Somebody's painting the lighthouse with a very rickety ladder. <laughs> so down this end. having a campfire. Oh, and why not? Look at that vehicle, aren't they? Yeah, I couldn't even tell you what it was. Some hikers. Oh, somebody painting on an easel. <laughs> Flying a kite here, look. <laughs> cool. That's and Pauline, you... there is a nudist colony. Oh. Oh dear, ah, not what we was expecting on here. Well, I'm not going to just say, there's something going on here. You've got your, your naturist, <laughs> and you've got some pervert filming him. <laughs> He's got his binoculars, has he? He's got a camera, <laughs> and it ain't me. <laughs> See him there, look. Oh, yes. In his, in his anorak on. <laughs> Dirty old man. <laughs> I'm having a nice sunbay there. She's overdressed. <laughs> For this area. It's like a bloody carry on film, isn't it? <laughs> but David Asseloff here. Uh. Oh, I like this. Well, we like something that's got a bit of fun to it. I mean, why oh, let's not? Let's look at these naked people again. Right, enough now. One chap there <laughs> taking his drawers off. <laughs> and two um, ladies showing the gardens. What's, it, what's going on here? He's painted. Oh. Don't look, Bob. <laughs> oh, it's cool, this. Get a tractor under there under the bridge. Go on, show us. What can What's you that, see sorry? in there? Uh, oh, <laughs> in between. I was looking in the window, obviously, no. at the wrong place. No, up the gimmel. <laughs> up right. the gimmel. I'm the riddle. Oh. <laughs> That's good. I'm loving this. Yeah. It's got a bit of fun to it. It's the lady of the evening here with the breast. Ah. It's duck beating that shopkeeper's brush. <laughs> Yeah. Do you like me, Undertaker? I thought it was hilarious. You really did. Well, everybody was taking it so seriously. Yeah. Oh, like yes. I agree. Let me do it for a couple of hours. Oh, it's funny. It's yeah. funny. It reflects the real world. <laughs> yeah. and the world can be a fun, strange place. Yeah. We want it boring. Yeah. 37 set with that coach, so this probably it's the older one. I'd say 1975 or something like that one. All right. Yeah. You know, the Highlander. You got a Weetabix van in there. <laughs> Only 35. But yeah, that will have all the the male car stuff in as well. Five for 50. Not bad at all, is it? There's an awful lot going on behind here. Oh, me. 37.
I think I can see Wally, but I don't want to shout because of the kids around. Wally's they won't hear you. Where is he? Wally's on the bridge with, near the phone box. He is indeed. I don't know Max and Ollie the dog. Sounds ready to go. Maybe. There we go. Growing his crop. Yeah. Oh, and here's a train. <gasps> Good timing with that. How oh, lovely, look at that detail on it. Lazy moment. It's a lazy cow. <laughs> Might mean there's rain on the way. I do like how it's very raised up, you know, the track bed. Yeah. Because yeah. so many are, it's, it's not often you notice them this. I mean, the bridge is really good, isn't it? Mm. What's going on here? I think there's an old cow without its wheels. Look at that plow. I know. Pumpkins. You see the loon. Luckily, nobody's done it on this one. Oh, who's doing the washing? Some cabbages, leeks, maybe. Lovely house. Oh, there's a purple wheelie bit behind there as well. Fancy that. Long yeah, gear, but never days, mind. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a grave digger. Oh yeah, that often is a grave digger, is it? Yeah, no. I'm just sat in a swing. Oh, a little porch there yeah. at the back of the house. Get round the back then and get. Where are you box. going? See that painting there? Yeah. Nice in the lounge, that, wasn't it? No. <laughs> What's wrong no. with it? It wouldn't, darling. You just don't appreciate art. No, not having it. Sorry, darling. <gasps> Rick, do you know what I've got? Let's take us to that. Not that there's favouritism on this side, but... No, no, no. Uh, you want one? Professionally weathered. It's, um, it's like a Mark 1 full break. Yeah. Are you filming that little bit on the end? Do you know Tried we to. Fi we'll, 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 we'll fire these... Uh... <laughs> What's this? That looks very nice. That is nice. Very new. It is, isn't Great it? Great paintwork on it, yeah. Mm. Fit. That's how it fit. Restaurant car. Very nice. And there's the bright blue one. Oh yeah, the network safe east. Nice, that. I like that. It is a nice livery. Yeah. We've got one local in that livery, um, oh, the 73. Yeah. We need to get some more. So I was looking over here. Go on. 37. That green 40 at the bottom, that is really nice. Oh yeah. Monster. It the, is. The 37 and Beautiful the 47. Tall. It's very long, a lot of wheels. Yeah. There is actually, isn't there how you said it? I didn't yeah. really spot it before, but yeah. Yeah, but rare one next door. Look at that thing at the top there. That yellow one. Mm. 
It's unusual. I've only got another 40 there, look. I've got a couple of them. I do like those. Yeah. Especially in green. Why, <laughs> why we bought a blue one. <laughs> so you can still get a green one, is that it? I think we need to. Look at that. Black. It is, it says Ferry Van British Rail. Oh, but it's in black. You got a yellow brake van. It's very bright, isn't it? <laughs> what miss that in the dark? Yeah, it's good that. Yeah, Christmas wagon. It's not very often you oh, see him on the moon. Look. Oh, what have you found? Oh. Dapper. Oh, and his happy birthday one there as well. <laughs> Should we get that? Yeah, we like that. You did have a yellow one, didn't you? Is it yellow? Yeah, they had a yellow Apple. one. Uh, yeah. you, is it here? Oh yeah, we didn't buy it unfortunately. Uh, we, 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 we forgot. Oh, there they are. Pauline's going in the field for some freebies as usual. <laughs> what do you think she got this time? Show us what you've nicked. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> She's still mic'd up. Oh, oops. They're not stolen. They're not stolen. Oh. I've seen the lights so. though. Stop to the signal this one here. Eh? I've been able to see inside. <laughs> Coaches are ace, aren't they? What do you think of the station? It's so simple, but well, that's exactly what a lot are like, you know. Yes. They don't always have a lot to them. No. I've just noticed the wall over there and it being held up. Yeah, the um, retaining things. Yeah. And again, another crane for the the lorries and so on. <laughs> I was thinking that bridge like a Harry Potter bridge. Would be actually, <laughs> yeah. I mean even the detail here is amazing. Yeah. We'll gradually work our way around. Oh, there's a pub in the background. Always need a pub. <laughs> Do the pub now. Look at this fence work here, Polly. Wow. Yeah. No, no dead end when it just disappears. Mm. It's no. no cement it's... works. Oh, look at those. The man on his stack of truck there. Wow. Look at the tools. Oh. Just catching in. There. It's nice to see how it works actually. You know, the mm. pop and everything. The amount of tracks are standing, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, double 237's coming up here, look. I think it's just reversing. Oh, look. Two of them, again, yeah. yeah. They've got the double deckers, love. Love them. So want to go in one of those. I think it's German. That's 
a problem we're not doing around here. <laughs> around these parts. And there's a tram at the top. Need to shot now. Oh yeah, and it's really oh you can see it moving. Oh look at this. Oh it looks a bit unusual, is it very long, long bodied? Quite a slim boy though. Well, see the pants we have to move up and down, you know, with the with actually touching the lines. That's good, that. The buildings here. This is East Germany, this one, I remember. Ah. Somebody working on it, barely a floor left, to be honest. So moving up and down, that's nice that. I like to see that. The buildings are just so different though, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, nice. How long it is. The Stanton wagon in the. Replica railways again, yeah. Yeah, ours is, um, ours is new, isn't it? Ours is a Batman. Oh, is it? Yeah. I think the. the Poundsbury. I think the Batman probably took over the tooling for it and mm. made it better. No, it's actually a completely different wagon. Ours is a, it's taller, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Oh. Oh, well, sure. That's a nice one. Yeah, it's a, it's a J94. Ah, that's why I liked it. I'll show you these. Those are one. So these were um, customised by somebody. So it's an old Graham Farish wagon. Yeah. But they put a Pico chassis on it, which is much more detailed. Right. So it's happened with all these here. That one as well. Maybe yeah. better. Oh, cool. There's another one so in the They'll be me. worse. It's a, a double O one, that. It's not one of them. So I don't know if it's about what they were, but they have been improved. Only three £10 wagons for 25 What's that one? It's just unusual. I don't know if that's... It's a very nice one. It's a salt wagon, isn't it? Where they have the sloping roof to stop the water getting on the salt. Right. Oh, this is another one that's been done like that. Beef stock tubes. Yeah. Oh, yes. You can see the detail on the chassis here, though. On the ah. separate bits. On a, a wagon you wouldn't be able to get with a, you know, more detail on it. Yeah, yeah. How much is that? Are they five pounds each, more or less, silver wagons? Yeah, yeah. Mm. It's all made by Lima. Yeah. All produced by Lima, and it wasn't particularly good either, unfortunately. Uh, it was a bit out of the scale and a bit wobbly. I know, some of them were quite big, weren't they? Yeah. Um, but I remember... You look at, you look at the, the Lima uh, wagons, and they're totally out of scale. Right. I've never looked at them closely. They're too big. Well, this Lima was selling at the same time as the Ren ones, weren't they? Yes. Yeah. But it's interesting, Lima went to trying to look at the drawings, right. but didn't realise they were o double O. And so uh, they were doing it in HO. Oh, I see. So the way they converted it meant that they ended up with, with something that was actually too big. So yeah. you compare, compare the size. The graphics, yeah. There's a, a hell of a ah, difference. There is when you see them next to each other, isn't there? Yeah. 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 
So wow. it's interesting, they got it completely wrong because they didn't understand what they were measuring mm. when they decided to produce the wagon. What I didn't know is Wren were planning on doing um, a prairie loco. Oh, right. When actually the bit of digging into it was actually the Lima one. Oh, right. They were just going to sell through their stuff. It's a plastic one. And it, every, all the, the comments are, it was an absolutely awful model, so I don't think they bothered him. That's why probably one of the reasons they didn't but bother. They did some nice ones. They did an overhead electric loco. Yeah. Uh, which was actually gorgeous. The was one in my collection. Mm. But it, that was really good. But this one, as you can see, it looks completely wrong. Yeah. The, the body's the wrong shape. Looks out, looks out the sink, doesn't look right. I mean, this one, they did in H O and O, didn't they? Yes. Yeah. Yes. I had one of those in H O back in the seventies. Mm. Same colour as well. Yeah. I mean, that's not a bad representation, but some of them, as I say, they didn't get quite right at all. Right. And uh, it, it's interesting to say it's sort of a bit nerdy. You might say a bit nerdy, but to find these things out. Mm. It's quite fascinating, right? Well, well I, yeah. I get the same at home, so. <laughs> <laughs> it's phenomenal, isn't it? Isn't it? So it's a bit of room up this. Have you seen the camper van there? Oh. I'm going to get one eventually. Oh my god, look at this. It is oh, Percy. He's looking, He's at, looking you at you, then. staring at me, yeah? Oh. <laughs> it's Teddy Bear in the back. That's good, this, isn't it? He's got sound on those. Little shunts on a wagon. That's um, nice. Superhero train. It's great, it's isn't it? Like everywhere, isn't yeah. It? Oh, it's giving me the evil eye. <laughs> Brilliant, isn't it? Here's Thomas hiding out here. Look. It's waiting for his turn, isn't it? Yeah. What, Thomas? Bath man, isn't it? That's the matey bubble bath, isn't it? <laughs> Coffee. There's a campsite down there. Do you want to have a look? Polly, campsite or a circus, whatever there. Yeah, you can see the lions being trained. Yeah, and a so castle well. over so there. They don't have that anymore, do they? <laughs> Oh, a tiger loose with the elephant. Watch out. Perfectly proportioned. <laughs> so I like them when there's you know, something different. Yeah, yeah. Industrial and a this... quarry, whatever it is. Oh, look. I love the bridge. Love the bridge. Yeah. You do, don't you? I love bridges, I love water. And a, and a, and a windmill, which is always good for you. <laughs> I like these little hoppers. I was just going to say that, how tiny those are as well. Around, yeah. In comparison. Oh, it's more up around this side here. Eh? You can see the one coming through, you know. No, that's full. <laughs> These are narrow guides, that's, that's a big one, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Oops. Oh, where's it gone? Oh, there, there it is. we go. Parking up. We're going both in shot here. Lovely. There we go. Perch round there a bit. What's that one there? Is that a little like a caboose? It does, yeah. German. So which is the German? The, the German, that oh, white yes, caboose yes, thing, yeah. Yeah, probably don't need back. It's one of the old Igabarn ones. Ah. About 1960s, we've just achieved. Is it? 1960s, yeah. Nice, I like that. that. That's the Preservation Society depot, they're just itching to take over. We've <laughs> seen 1960s health and safety practices at, yes. <laughs> at the room. Yeah. Yeah, no scaffolding involved. No. So these are the ones that for sale of the railway, aren't they? Yes. Yeah, yeah. We, we got that one there yep. last time we were here. Ah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Biggles Kelly Lime one. That's more down here. 
Yeah. Single one I didn't realise. They're all the same. Yeah. All lethal, aren't they? Gaslight general trading. Yeah, they've all got loads in, I think, as well. Oh, I'm over in a minute. St. Ivan's. Sydney <laughs> Fire with either the station master or the Sunday station master in the forest. Ah, oh, right. Oh, on the water, yeah. Uh, wonderful. What? Oh, sorry, yeah. Uh, water. Uh, very nice. Still a bit of work doing on here, isn't there? I just know. Well, yeah. A month ago, it didn't exist. Right. Ah, wow. Well, well done then. Yeah. <laughs> That's a month's work. Well, well done. If we come round in another couple of hours, it'll be finished. <laughs> Get a bit old. Uh, six times a creep. Uh, Very good. Creeping's good. Now it's stuck creeping so much. Oh. It's stuck on the thing. Then. Right, I'm going to try it. Uh, okay. Now we'll creep. Okay, start on the middle. Okay, turn it back to zero. Yep. Right, excellent. Now. We're going to turn it right through 180 degrees, so 360 degrees. It's set, all you have to do is turn it towards you. Nice and slow, nice and slow. Just keep it going. Oh, there we go. There it goes. Want it stopping there? No, no, no. All the way around. No short measures here. <laughs> Look! <laughs> I'm doing it! <laughs> no speeding now. I know, I'm so itching to turn it up even further. Bit, turn it back a little bit more. But you do it very slow. No, not here. Yeah, keep, going. keep going, don't let it stop. It's not that one thing. <laughs> I, was, I think I'm just practicing just, on the. Yeah. Two. Okay, just focus on the last rail coming up. Oh, oh. Stop. absolutely spot on! Wow, that was a fluke. It, what? I no, no, I'm not saying it. Uh, I'll, I'll okay. take that though. We are going to now drive it back in. Now pass the signal. Pass this signal here. Okay. Oh, that's the North Eastern, that's the 25, isn't it? J25. Oh, tw is it? Yeah. That's the bigger one. So it's so 25. It's a so slow it down here. Stop it up to the, up to the point. Okay, you'll do. Uh, I use that. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. Um, yeah, that, that is a proprietary yeah. one. Yeah. 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 This way works though. Yeah. It is working. It is, I think that's what it is. It's the heat has expanded the rail just very slightly. And it's touching in a certain when the polarity's been changed. What I got <laughs> You're all jealous, aren't you? <laughs> sure, diesels. Ah, oh, dude. <laughs> Do you have any diesels on here, so? Just the one, the little one. <laughs> Where do you want me to stop? Just on the trail. Oh, right, okay. You're, you're taking it right off. <laughs> oh, look. It's a lovely engine, that, isn't it? No, no, it's... 
here today. No, no, no. It's about four months from so with those, if you go Get ready to stop in the middle, that will do nicely, and then we're going to turn it. So what, how they those work? Is it if you stop over them, the automatic? You see the little tail. Yeah. No, the well, you've got to take the weight off it, and they should then spring apart. Right. Each tail should go in the other opposite right. directions. And when you're pulling it, it's the tension of the thing, the tension of the things between each other, keeping keep it together. <laughs> Oh, yep, certainly. I'll let you do the honours. And I think with anything like this, it's just practice to see how fast it goes. Yeah. It is. Yeah. It is. Oh, it stopped. Oh, there we go. Sorry. <laughs> So it's all practice so isn't it with these? All the way down to here, okay. to the... Uh... Oh, right, okay. So what? Seen often. <laughs> What's that? Look at this. Yeah, Look sorry. at that sign. <laughs> That's well, how lovely. Well, like. All these offers on that. Look at these lovely bridges here. Look at those. <laughs> Somebody's working on that one, taking the roof off and working on it. You said that one was long, look at this one. Very bright, isn't it? This is what you want, because there's so much detail in there, it's a shame to hide it away, isn't it? Yeah. And it's nice to see things actually in there, you know, be able to see through the windows and see what's going on. You see a couple of 56s and a shunter in there, a couple of them. Come out of the dark. Look at these sunshades. There's a peak class. 45.090. I think there must be hundreds of wagons on this layout. Yeah. Look at them all. Wow. And so much to see on the view as well, though. So, when you're looking at the signal box and the water tower and the aerial map. Mm. Look, like look at the other end. Yeah, let's. Oh, this is a contrast, isn't it? Isn't it? The washing out there. Yeah, I'll spot the washing. Windy day, by the look of it. Got a big signal box yeah. here as well. So, you know, it's got one up there and a big one here. Yeah, it's good, this. It's called Shire Brook. Like those trees, look at them. I know. They look so real, though, yeah. 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 You usually see everything, you know, in full bloom and that, but yes. it's nice to see something autumnal, you know, with a bit different time of year. And we occasionally see the odd snow layer. Yes. And this is um, more of a normal day, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. There's an awful lot going on on this. There's farm buildings. A couple of horse back over there. Mm -hmm. I do that, people can see that. Yeah. Yeah. 
Mm, wonderful. It's a nice model anyway, they're not cheap, but it's got a nice leather product. Yes. Mm. Lovely. Might as well wait for this one. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Look at the link. Look at it from here, Dave. I know, yeah. I've never seen a layout with so many wagons on. I know. <laughs> so everything's so tiny, obviously, with it being engaged. It's, it's wonderful detail. I was doing the wagon loads as well, even. Yeah. The graffiti on those, I think. You can imagine they're all being dropped one by one slowly, can't you? Filled up just so they're all the same. Loads of different wagons. Some older, some newer. Well, these used to come through um, Woodhead Way, didn't they? These others. So what else been fixed out of the. Uh... Oh, there's two little ones. <gasps> oh, wow, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? You like those, yeah? Oh, yeah. That's wonderful. So the, the standard one you buy has sort of various boxes and that on the side of, the, of this bit here. Yeah. So to make it realistic, I've pointed them to, and to, to taken boxes off. And, and the, so I've got to a bit long to extend the doors down because they're normally hidden by boxes and something. something oh. like it's, it's a bit of a fad. I'll say just the size of them. So the individual models as opposed to a... There's buttons! Look! Right, you want to press the red one there then? Did that go? Yeah. <laughs> we knew really, didn't we? Well, it's a nice station building here, look. It's a big one. I'll say, look at the size of it. Look at that building, it's beautiful. Well, this is what you see, you know, you do see a lot of these big old buildings. Well, I've never seen anything like this before. No. Another wagon there. Oh, it stops. stops. It's amazing, it's isn't it? Look at it. I've seen everything, but it's got trains, it's got trams, it's got Buses, all sorts. It's lovely. It's great well, to see. Said an Atkinson wagon. Ah. And the bus is coming by. And look at this wiring. I wouldn't like to say how long it took to get this lot together and put it away. Over here, you've got the tram depot, isn't it? Yeah. Looks like they're all out. Let's pull this wagon, where's he going? Well, like this. Look at the size it? of it. It's amazing. You know, Huge. it's what you can fit in. I and mean, when you've got such a massive layout, it's amazing what you can fit into it. <laughs> a lovely little bridge. Yeah. It was right round there to a castle lot. Oh wow. Can't wait Lovely. to get round. Oh, and we've got a worker, somebody else oh. um, working on it. Wonderful. Oh, where's the bus oh. going? Oh. Nice turning. Oh. I'm enjoying watching the kids do it as well. All plugging in. Who's the make it This is fantastic, this, isn't it? Yeah. And I just love seeing all the kids just going around and plugging in and having a go. You wouldn't expect it on a, such a big layout and you see so much well, detail and you just think... They're doing okay. This is what the kids love more than anything. It's well, going on down here. Not just the kids. <laughs> oh, look oh. at this bus. Oh, I'm old that It's amazing one. this. It's fantastic. <laughs> Follow the bus all the way down here. 
Yeah, <laughs> Most people say turn it off, but well, there you go. She's famous. <laughs> I've, I've been watching you for quite a long time. Oh, yes. uh, thank you. It really is. Well, that's it, mate, not too much. <laughs> yeah. I, I should want royalties, mate. <laughs> No, oh, this is amazing. This this thing, is though. a club layout. This is the Barnes and Model Railway Club, and that guy there, all these vehicles, in here. Yeah. He, he constructed these. He really. A model, and it, all the mechanism, the steering, he he done it himself. Oh yeah. wow! Some people have such a great talent, though, don't yeah. they, for these things? Because this bad thing about it, he's eighty-five now. And he's slowing down. Look at the castle. It goes even further. Look at that old ruin. Well, that's how they become, isn't it? You know. Yeah. Could have spent a whole day just filming this. <laughs> well, they've lovely invited us to visit so when I first saw it I was walking past it we couldn't get to it I thought it was like you know a couple of trams on a railway I didn't think it'd have all these vehicles on this it's a model village almost yes. isn't it? It's fantastic it really is nice you got the cars as well and this is a turning bit that you don't supposed to see but you know you can't help but have a look what look at the wheels turn on that thing Too. Fantastic. Isn't it? Oh, Pickford's removing. Yeah. Pickford's removers and storers. Fantastic. Cart wagon now, look at the detail on the back. Load. Yeah. Someone's done a great job, haven't they? Let's have a look in the castle. So much detail behind that. I know. Quite a late steam loco. Oh, right, okay. Yeah. 50s. <laughs> what I've just spotted as well. A light in that. Ah, uh, yeah. Moving along again. It's oh. an ugly little thing, isn't it? I, mean, yeah. I do like it, but it's Looks very like utilitarian looking, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. looks like you can see through it, though. You know, down at the wheels mm. on the other side. Yeah. It's the thing you see in a lot of layouts, you know, they have the glamorous, specific locos and that. Yeah. For most locos, which is, you know, very workmanlike. Yeah. They had a job to do, didn't they? Mm. Back to work now. You can, you, you get off, I'll finish up. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> no worries. Right, you were asking about this loco. Yeah. It's basically a Class 52, a heavy freight loco used in the Second World War and it was painted in camouflage livery for winter use. Mainly, I think, they were used on the Russian front. Right. Um, it's unusual camouflage, isn't it? Because you yeah. have the snow in that. I've got up here. What have Another we got? set. And that's in summer camouflage. Or wow. Oh. Unusual that, isn't it? Yeah, that's a class 42. What are these bits on the side there? Are they Armour plating. Oh, it's armour, right. I think to protect the pumps and what have you. Yeah. I've never seen that before. No. Yeah, unusual. Oh, they had some that were fully armoured. Mm. The bodies were completely enclosed, but uh, I think for maintenance, yeah. they reduced it down. Wow. Oh, wonderful. That's coming out, yeah, like that. That's a similar loco, only in later DB livery, as in late 40s, early 50s. Hmm. I've never noticed on these German locos the curvature of the tender. Yeah. It's almost like a boat, isn't it? Yeah. They hmm. called them tub tenders. Oh, right. 
um, whether it made it any easier for water to drain down or stop it rusting, I've no idea. That might be it, yeah, I was thinking about it. But, uh, they, they were a utilitarian loco made for the war, they, they cheating them down. All right. Um, I think the class 50 was the original sort of full spec loco and they left the uh, chrome wing mirrors off these. And then you got your, what you say, was the Rheingold Express? It's Rheingold Express coach set. Um, in the late 20s, early 30s, um, the Deutsch Reichsbahn, the German railway company, was uh, upset that uh, the Orient Express Company, CIWL, was taking a lot of the prestige trade away. Mm. So the Deutsch Reichsbahn produced their own uh, premium coach set and uh, fast passenger train that ran from the Hook of Holland down to Switzerland and I think Donald Dossel in Italy. And they ran basically as a five or six coach train, sometimes with a second baggage car. Door lights light up, the interior lights up, the table lights light up, you've got cooking sounds from the kitchen. And you can even get smoke coming out from the kitchens. Was it a successful train? Well, yes, the war stopped it. Right. But we won't mention the war. <laughs> no, but Basil Foley made that mistake, didn't he? So, yeah, it was successful compared yeah. to the Orient yeah. Express. Well, yeah. they, they resurrected it in the early 60s um, with newer coaches. I mean, right. these all had. Um, uh, laminated parquet wall coverings and oh, all sorts wow. have got, uh, they're, they're very stylish, individual uh, seats as opposed to benches. And yeah. Mm. Oh wow. They're really classy. It's Hornby's version, isn't it? What we just looked at. This is £29. Is it? Yeah. Well, there's Hornby's and there's the original main line one. And the first difference is the extra prints in here. There's not a massive difference, is there? Three times. I mean, the bogies look different, but those to me look better. Yeah. I think the paint works better on that as well. Obviously got more detail on the handles. But you could pick them out if you were really fussy. Couldn't you? Yeah. But for three times the price, I'd get three of those. Yeah. Put them back. Well, look at these. Can't see them very well. No, 120 quid. Wow. Kerner models exclusive. They're nice, aren't they? What colour are they? Very I... dark Southern Railways green. I thought so. Intercity exhibitions. So Bikeman Collectors is full of exclusive. Like an old GM bus, doesn't it? That's what I thought. That's what made me think. But intercity exhibitions, I have heard of that. We just went travelling around, you know, a show thing at the railway, from what I remember. Oh, right, I see. And the standout livery. £49, yeah. Now, I don't, I don't want to upset you or anything. No. After the one I got that was. Oh, this is far better. This is a Lima one.